today we're going to be opening up all my mail all the way back since November. I do have a lot of stuff to open up today. It's all mail from Instagram vendors to eBay. Let's get cracking. Squirtle Squad. So let's check it out. I have not opened anything since last November. Thank you, Turtle Squad. Packaged this very well. I did honestly forget a lot. I mean, I know what I bought, but there's a couple stuff I don't remember. Here we go. I got this uh, trainer. I've always liked this card, actually. I just never bought it, so thank you, Turtle Squad. Oh, she even threw a little Entei in there. So that's pretty cool. Maybe I will get it graded. Who knows? But very well packaged. Thank you very much. Another one by Squirtle Squad. Whoever I can, I will put um, their link down below to their Instagram or eBay page, whatever they have. The first time I bought from this person, Squirtle Squad, she actually sent me a little Snorlax sticker, which I actually stuck on my rear view window. Now it's on my Hydro Flask, but this time she sent a Typhlosion sticker, so that's pretty dope. Thank you very much. I appreciate the stickers. This is the Snorlax I bought from Squirtle Squad. This I actually bought for my girlfriend. I bought her a Snorlax because she is a Snorlax collector, and I love buying from Squirtle Squad because she always throws extra goodies in. There you go. Typhlosion sticker. That's going to go on my Hydro Flask for sure. Thank you, Maniac Ventures. No, thank you. And she actually threw an extra card in there because I don't remember purchasing this card from her. I already have it, but I do love this artwork. So thank you. All right, really do appreciate that. Snorlax, sticker, and slacking. That's dope AF. Third item. This might be an eBay package. Have any of you guys just bought a whole bunch of stuff and just, you know, stacked it up just so you can open it up and make your own Christmas morning. I feel like that's what I did. Um, I didn't do it with the intention of making a video, but I figured, hey, I have a stack of mail I haven't opened and might as well just crack it open together. So uh, thank you for your purchase. There you go. Oh, a Japanese card. I don't remember what these cards are. All right, let's open up this. A Lugia, nice. This is extra because I don't remember buying a Lugia from anyone. I don't have this card, so I appreciate it so much. Thank you. And then this is probably the card I purchased for sure. Let's check it out. Ooh, nice. I do remember buying this actually. A Team Rocket Arbok Japanese. I actually wanted to get one for grading. Um, and it seems to be in pretty good condition. What do you guys think? That is lovely. <laughs> that is that is nice. This is the other package that was in there. I'm most likely bought extra stuff from this person oh you guys aren't ready for this i bought it because i did want this card for grading for sure can you guys guess what it is oh oh yes neo lugia a little story about this i was actually gonna purchase this um maybe about seven months ago from a local seller and he wanted a it was an english version and it was pretty good he wanted fifty dollars I offered him the $50 and then I messaged him to see where we can meet up and I can pick up the card. I don't know what happened, but he did not want to sell me the card for $50 anymore. I offered him even 70 and he didn't take the bike. So I had to settle with this, this Japanese Lugia with this line down here is a little thicker compared to the top one. I just bought it for the artwork. This is a sick ass Lugia. Oh. This one, I actually do remember. I'm not only a fan of just um, the Pokemon cards and the games, but I also, I love art. I really do love art. And I love and I appreciate people that have the art skill to draw. And this is what I bought from this person because he's really, really, really good at being an artist. And he even wrote a little thank you note. He called it a Mimi Carp. So that's pretty dope. Let's actually look, look, take a peek inside. Five out of 24, only 24 prints of these. It's over an original Pokemon card. I wonder what card he used. This is nice. Seller Pokechella, and this is a person from Instagram. A lot of these people like to throw in extra goodies, so I appreciate them and I, I like supporting them. Oh, a first edition Dark Gold Bat. A first edition Misty Dugong. 
Duke on. And a first edition blank. I don't have a lot of first edition cards, and um, these are pretty cool. Pokechella. Thank you, my guy. Baby Brawly. Actually, Baby Brawly actually has his own YouTube channel. He's uh, mainly all Yu-Gi-Oh. I am gonna put his link down below in the description. Definitely check out his channel. Hey bro, thanks for the purchase, doing business with you. Always, thanks for the support. Baby bro, I did buy a summon skull from him. I don't have this card. I used to have it back in the day. My story is, I threw it all out. I was all stupid. My family at the time got really religious, so, so did I. Um, and I did the stupidity of throwing away mostly all of my collection of Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh. So I've been trying to just buy it all back. Um, so nice. Thank you. Appreciate it. Ambassador Pokemon shop. All right. Oh, yes. Guys, Dragonite sticker. Lovely. I love Dragon types. Dragonite is my top three favorite Pokemon or character of anything. So this is really nice that they were able to throw this in there so now we got um now we have a um typhlosion and here we go and like i said this is so nice i think my girlfriend bought this card a couple of months ago from tchq i got my own i don't i don't like sharing so i got my own dragonite thank you for the sticker i really appreciate that michael tibbets let's check it out at many adventures do not bend so far so good i love the packaging when they send off a card um they, you know they don't they don't play around they really do send it very well protected so that your merchandise gets to you secured this is a japanese for sure i don't remember what it is but let's look oh yeah scissor scissor for sure, again, along with Dragonite, on my top three for sure, it's just the design of this Pokemon. When I first saw it, I just, I wish I was him. I wish, I wish I was a Scizor. Riding on Dragonite, that'd be pretty dope, huh? This mail is from Gothic Trades. Ooh, seems kind of fat, like they threw a little extra in there. nice all right here we go thank you for your support i have been trying to collect a lot of tune cards from tune chaos i've been trying to build my own personal tune chaos deck so i'm trying to accumulate anything that has tune in it so i can do that so this was my comic hand i bought from him three extras oh nice this is dope this was extra you guys know what this card is you guys know what it is if you know you know Let's check it out, see what I got off eBay. Very well protected and a thick AF cardboard. Here we go, we're gonna check this out. Oh, I remember what this is, I do remember. Um, I've been, well, you should know what this card is too. And um, I actually got this card at a very decent price. Boom, my ancient Mew. I do remember having this card when I was little, but again, my story, I threw it all out be able to have the funds to actually buy this card again and have it in my collection it's just i'm grateful 8.5 centering surface was a 9.5 the corners were a 10 and the edges were a 9 ancient mew now i'm able to add oh it has a swirl it has a swirl this is my first cg cgc um, graded card so even though I have a whole bunch coming in stay tuned for that video but this is dope a mew with a swirl you guys are jelly I can tell Scott Pratt oh I actually bought this from SM Pratt SM Pratt thank you so much I am a huge fan he actually did send this from you know very well protected cardboard all around uh, he even wrote thank you should I save this I feel like I should save that but SM Pratt thank you so much I'm a big supporter of you and here we go Japanese booster box which I will be opening in a separate video so again stay tuned for that um, SM Pratt thank you so much very well packaged at a very good price I'm very happy with this this is a uh, another eBay package is it even Pokemon related? Who knows? Oh, yes, it is. <laughs> so, 
I was able to get my hands on this blister, um, Unbroken Bonds. It was either going to come with Typhlosion, Sceptile, and I forget what the other monster was going to be, but um, yeah. And it was a very decent price. I actually bought this for $14, so $14 for um, three Unbroken Bonds booster packs. That's a pretty good. That's a pretty good deal. We came with a coin, Typhlosion. Do we have any swirl in that Typhlosion? No swirls, but still a lovely card. This is from Milk Caddy on Instagram. Thank you, no. Nice, Sceptile, here we go. So Sceptile is pretty cool. Another of my favorite starter final evolutions for sure. And uh, I bought this Butterfree Bookmark as well. So that's pretty dope. Butterfree and Sceptile. Guys, this is just pure nostalgia today. Everything I bought was just pure nostalgic. And ooh, oh, nice. I forgot I purchased this from her actually, but I fell in love with this artwork. I think it's pretty dope. I like how there's like faintly more Beedrills back there. Um, I don't see any swirls. So that's pretty cool. Thank you so much. And uh, very well packaged, very happy. This box from eBay, FedEx. Let's see what we get in here. Oh, I purchased it for $34. And this is a Needle King starter deck and it comes, this is in French, but there's a pack in here. And for $34, Heart Gold, Soul Silver era, that's a pretty good buy. So this is going in my sealed collection for sure. I'm not going to open this ever. This came all the way from France. So thank you so much for this eBay seller. You guys are jelly. And thank you, you guys, for watching the whole video. I really do appreciate you guys so much. Finally did make it to 100 plus subscribers. So that's a good milestone for me. No, just don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment what your favorite Mel Day video uh, item was today. Whoa. Subscribe, guys. It really helps me a lot. Help me reach my goal of reaching more of you. There you go. Another one from my seal collection, actually. I was pretty excited getting these. Um, English prices of Pokemon have really gone up the roof. But, so I've been searching somewhere else for, you know, to get my seal collection up. And I actually purchased this Korean tag team. I don't know if I'm going to open this in the video. Um, I don't know if I'm just going to keep it sealed. So far, take your pick. What is the best Mel Day item of the day? The last item for today. I know what this item is. But as you guys know, I do love Yu-Gi-Oh! as well. It's another one I grew up with. And uh, my channel does consist of Yu-Gi-Oh! and Pokemon unwrappings. But Korean... Um, I forget what the set was called. But I know it's pretty expensive. The English cards of these are, are pretty expensive. Thank you guys for tuning in. I do appreciate you guys so much. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. It really helps with the algorithm and I just love sharing my experiences with you guys. Be real, stay real, bite.